Hello everyone, Snowflake through here. Welcome to another Munch Pack. Munch Pack. pack. November Munch edition. Pack. What? <laughs> November's Munch Pack. And as always, if you guys are interested in picking up your official Munch Pack, there's a link down below. Click that link and you can get. Please have something good in here for once. All of these amazing Please. treats. This one, this munch pack was made super special with awake chocolate. Super special. Super special. Wait, read on the back. Wake up with caffeinated chocolate. Caffeinated. One, one chocolate bar equals one cup of joe. Wow. Wow. Yeah, impressive. Um, I called dibs on the awake bar. First, we open up the official munch pack with their awesome munch pack tissue paper. First item up for grabs is Tato. is Tato for potato, which is cheese and onion. Cheese and onion Tato. Well, these are all so unusual. I mean, like it's so cool, but tastes like a regular potato chip. Not bad. Not bad for Tato. <laughs> <laughs> Next item is. A Looks like it's supposed to be Doritos. Um, 12, whoa, looks like it's like Espanol Doritos. Espanol Doritos? Espanol. Oh wow, 12% mas producto. Like I said, Espanol Doritos. It's Espanol Doritos. Oh, check them out. They're, they're like inflated. They're like little puffy Doritos. I was reading like the stickers more. They are Doritos. Three days quesos. Not too bad. We're actually two for two on goodness so far. Next item up feels like a hard candy. These ones are uh, Kappa Men. Nakma. 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 Sure, I'm going with it. These ones feel like a hard candy. Like a caramel. I like caramel. It's caramel, not caramel. Caramel, caramel, same thing, but that's kind of like what these are. They're like kind of squishy, but they're kind of hard at the same time. How many of you say caramel, not caramel? It's caramel. They're actually not caramel at all. They're like a... Uh, Nougat? They're like a little... Oh, that wasn't expected. Mm -hmm. They're almost like a... Uh, what are those triangle candies? Um, the Halloween... Uh, candy corn. Candy corn. Exactly. That's exactly what those taste like. It's like candy corns. Uh, those are alright. They, they have kind of a caramel taste them. Yeah. Next one up. Chili Millie. <laughs> Whatever the heck a Chili Millie is. I feel like these are going to be really good. I hope I didn't just jinx it. There's no wood anywhere I can knock on, so. Chili Millie. If these are spicy. This will make my day. They're like little gummies. They're supposed to be a shape of a chili, but, um... This one's the shape of a chili. That one's more the shape of a snake. How's the chili Millie? Hot. Yeah. It's burning my face. <laughs> She's her face is turning her head. <laughs> I'm glad I let you... <laughs> it's burning me, like, a throat. Whoa, your breath is burning my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, my eyes are like sizzling. I'm ugly and I'm proud. <laughs> well, while she's over there passing away from all the chili, oh. next one up is Tem Tema Yik Yiva. I can't even pronounce That's it. Candy corn thing. Ah. But these things uh -uh. look pretty cool. They're like little, like grape jelly looking, like hard candy looking things. Mmm. That's exactly what they are. They're like a, uh, <coughs> they're like a grape, hard, they're like a grape hard candy. Here, put, those ones will mellow you out a little bit. Those ones are actually really good. Those, those I can't pronounce what they are, but those are actually super good. So the Chili Millies, if you guys get, if you guys had it, 
Those ones are a little on the spicy side. Next item up, Chills Salt and Pepper Potato Sticks. Like, yeah. Oof. Wow, that oh one had God. some pressure to it. Chili Millies. No. Why did you have to do this to me? Mm. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper potato sticks. They don't really taste like much. Yeah, they, they taste, taste like pepper. a they taste like a stale French fry. Next item. Ooh. <gasps> They're all like pushed up to the top in here. Gummy strawberries with cream. Wait, 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 wait. let me see. They have actually like strawberry gummies and then the cream gummies. Yeah, check it out. I'm assuming. Oh no, that's just the back of the strawberry. Can you see oh, this? these things smell amazing. There's the front of them and there's the back of them. Oh my god. That's definitely a win. <laughs> that's the, this is definitely a win. Those are good. I will eat those. those. I'm eating the rest of this. Those are actually pretty good. Next item up, a Prince Polo. And I gotta read the whole thing. That is the whole, oh. Olza, oh, oh, it's an Olza Premium. Prince Polo Premium White it? Chocolate Confection with Coconut. Coconut. With Coconut. Ooh. Here comes the coconut. Strawberry <laughs> <Boop. laughs> <laughs> Boop. Don't put me in <laughs> What is this thing called? Prince Polo? It's a Prince Polo with coconut. Coconut? With coconut. I like coconut things. Oh, I can see the coconut on top. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even a big fan of white chocolate. This is actually pretty good. Prince Polo with coconut. How is it? Kind of like a sugar wafer with white chocolate. On top. Sugar wafer with coconut. With coconut and white chocolate. Next item, sour belts. I'm assuming that'd be like the sour patch kids. Yeah, those are just like the sour patch kids. That's exactly what those are. Sour belts. These ones actually, I can show you real quick. Oh, oh my gosh! It, it fell apart already. These ones smell like bubble gum. Okay, so maybe they're not like the Sour Patch Kids ones. Those smell like bubble gum. Hold on to one. Oh my god. What the heck? <laughs> it's a sour bracelet. It's a sour belt. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> it tastes like bubble gum. I think they are gum. Mm -mm. No? Mine's break. Ugh. Interesting aftertaste. Yeah. Like, it's so weird. It's like a Sour Patch Kid gum belt. Gone wrong. <laughs> not bad though. Not bad. They're not bad. Next item up is a Duplo. It's a Ferrero Duplo Gonza Ness. Kai Ferrero Shays. I don't know. We'll see. Like a Duplo of the Rochers? Is, isn't yeah, Duplo, <laughs> doesn't Duplo make like building blocks for kids? That actually looks pretty good. It's like a wafer. It's like, like a fur Rocher. Yeah. It's is a that, Ferrero Rocher. Wow. That's a Ferrero Rocher. It's a Forever Rocher. It tastes exactly like it too. I told you it's a Forever Rocher. Forever. Not too bad, I like those a lot. Aw, oh, we already cut through this whole thing. Okay. Well, last but not least, the star of the Munch Pack. Can I, can I toss this? The oh. weight bar. Looks fancy. A weight caffeinated cho chocolate. <laughs> cho <laughs> I wanted to see a sponge, chocolate milk. milk. Do we have to open it? Like this is the caffeinated chocolate bar. So I need that for like school tomorrow. Right? If you ever have those days where you're like, you could be like. It kind of reminds me of the caffeinated then, marshmallows. Yeah. 
She'll have to take this to school for those days where school's super boring. She can pop this and sneak a couple of bites of this and she'll be zipping around the room in no time. I'm super tired in the mornings anyways. Yeah. Well, there you guys go. That concludes and wraps up our Munch Pack November edition. It was actually pretty good. Yeah, this one was a good one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And as always, if you guys want to subscribe to one, there's a link down below. Click that link, sign in for up today, and you guys can have all these amazing treats all for yourself. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you next month. Bye-bye.